Hi Tejas. Hi Deeple. Hello friends, I'm Tejas. Welcome to Tejas Tejora Networking Channel. In this video, we will learn Cisco EP discovery process for WLC method 5 and method 6. Enjoy this video and keep watching. Thank you. Tejas, yesterday you taught me the method 4 of Cisco wireless AP discovery process of WLC. Can you teach me the method 5 also? Oh sure Deeple. Method 5 is statically configured WLC IP in access point. Look at to this diagram. Let me first configure the DHCP server. Okay. Now let's power on the access point. Hi, I am access point, and I require IP address and gateway. Hi access point, I am switch 1 and with me there is one DHCP server is connected. I will inform your request to them. Hi DHCP server, I am switch 1 and with me there is one access point is connected and he require IP address and gateway. Okay switch 1. I am sending him IP address and gateway. Now let me configure the controller IP address in access point. Hi switch 1, I am access point. I am sending you one packet of CAPWAP UDP protocol with WLC IP details. Can you forward that to WLC? Oh sure access point. Hi WLC, I am switch 1. With me there is one access point is connected, and he had sent a one packet for you. I am forwarding that to you. Hi Switch1, I am WLC. Thank you, this packet is for me. Hi WLC, I am Access Point. I would like to join you. I am sending you the joining request. Hi Access Point, I am WLC. Send me your certificate and other details. OK. I am sending the certificate and other details. I Access Point your IOS image is not compatible. I am sending you the IOS image. Oh ho. My flash is not having space. Let me delete the current image from my flash. I deleted the current image. 
Now I am downloading the new iOS image from WLC. Now I am booted with the new iOS image. I am now power on. Hi WLC, I would like to join you. I am sending the joining request to you. Hi Access Point, send me your certificate and other details. Okay. Hi Access Point, your joining request is accepted. I am sending you the configuration details. I WLC, I am Access Point. I successfully joined you. Thank you. See Deepal this is how method 5 works. I also had taken some capture that I would like to show you. Okay. Power on the access point. Access point booted with the recovery image. Access point had taken IP from DHCP server. Now I will configure the WLC IP in the access point. See Deeple you can see that access point is sending a joining request to WLC. WLC has confirmed that iOS image is not compatible. Now access point is downloading the iOS image from WLC. Access point is up now with the new iOS image.
see again it sent the joining request. And in this time access point join the controller. Now controller will send the configuration. See this is how method 5 works. Okay Tejas, can you teach me the method 6 also? As you see on method 5 I had configured WLC IP in access point. If this access point is not used in production and for some reason it's sent to another office. On that time if WLC IP is same then no requirement to configure the access point. It will automatic join the WLC if it get IP from DHCP server. If WLC IP is different then you need to configure and previously known controller method will not work. Okay. Tejas I understand all the method of Cisco wireless AP discovery process of WLC. Thank you.